So we were, we were outlining and we were in paragraph 14. And then in paragraph 14 we find that, yes, we note it down. Now go to paragraph 15. Para 15. So what do you see in para 15? Okay. Greeting style. What examples are given? No, first American example. How do they greet? At arm's length. Then Japanese example. How do they greet? Two feet distance. Greeting. Then how do the Arabs greet? Arab example. They have social kiss. Kissing someone in public as form of greeting. Then, okay, then we move to paragraph 16. Para 16. And um, let's quickly scan. So para 16 says space use has real effect on people and give the example of American pilot who flies to Egypt and says that these sons of bitch in Egypt how can they hold their hands well in public because Americans unless they are gay will not hold hands of another man while walking down the street. Effect. Then para 17. Let me write here. Para, I don't have any space there. You, can, you should write below. Para 17. So now solution. Now come here this side. Now write here. Para 17. Draw a line. Solution to problem. Para 17. Now what solution is he suggests? He says that what is needed is we need coaching and time. For what? To acculturate to foreign habits of contact. So Americans need coaching like this essay. Then they will learn foreign habits of contact. And they need some time. When they spend some time in foreign culture, they will learn. So para 17. Solution to the problem? Now para 18. What is in 18? Conclusion of the essay. What is the conclusion? Conclusion is people can Learn, people can learn how to use personal space if they get coaching and time. So, do you see the essay ends? Wait, wait, don't take photographs. This has, this has a problem. You know, I, I found that when you have technology and when you rely too much on technology, you are not exercising your brain. You are not exercising your brain. And when you snap, then the information will be in a mobile phone, but probably it will not be in your mind. So what's important is not what you record in the mobile phone. What's important is what you save in your mind. Save in your mind's memory, not the, in the digital memory, okay? Okay. So, what I did today, one more thing before I leave the class, I didn't tell you. In different paragraphs, what I didn't tell you in this class, in different paragraphs, Lisa Davis refers to psychologists anthropologists like Edward Hall, Mildred, Mildred Hall and also she mentions about uh, trainers like Peter Bechtold 
Her essay begins with Peter Bechtold in paragraph 5, 1 and ends with Peter Bechtold in paragraph 18. Now your job is, when you come to class tomorrow, the next essay, the next essay in the course, you will show me one single page of any size you like, any size you like, you can, you can even buy cardboard of 5 feet, 10 feet, I don't mind. But tomorrow in class, everybody will submit me a single page where they prepare such an outline of the next essay in our course. I don't know the next essay. I don't know the next essay. You check. So your job is find the next essay, find the text, read it. And do what I did for you in class. If you want some help, watch this video which I will load by the evening. Or watch the video, it's already loaded there. You will learn how to do it. Any questions? I know it's difficult. I know you're not happy. I know. I know you're not happy. People are not happy when they have to work. Right? But I know if I can make you work, you will develop. Thank you.